two, one. Starting off, uh, we're at Taunton College on March the 13th. We had Sugar Push was the emphasis of the night. So we had one, two, three, and four, two, four, five, and six. Next Sugar Push, we spoke about the principles of Sugar Push, which were compression to equal forces, matching forces. We did an exercise. Um, we had ladies making sure that your frame was nice and um, rigid, ladies with a little bit of flexibility in it for the Sugar Push. Like so. We then did a couple of variations. These are the variations we did. We had one, two, Three and four, five and six. Second variation was a half moon. We had one, two, three and four, triple five and six. Then we're moving your frame out. One, two, three and four, five and six. Ladies, you making sure that your frame was locked in for that one. Uh, intermediate class, all the way through the intermediate class looked like this. We had one, two, hitch three, back and four, triple five and six. Ladies, hitch on count three. Hitch up on three, went back on four, cross in front, five and six. We then went into a little sequence. We had walk, walk, trip, pull, step, trip, pull, step, trip, pull, step, into close, step here. From here we had a sugar push. Gentlemen, we changed the axis around. We had one, two, three, and four, triple five and six. I progressed away on four rather than lady. That one more time. We had one, two, three, and four, triple five and six. We then had a second variation of our sugar push. We had one, two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, three, and four, five, and six. That's a little great line we did. So we were here on count four, we could triple around on five, and six. I widened the frame for the great vines. The great vines was rotation on the body, gentlemen. So we went and seven, and eight, and one, and two. We finish it with a touch turn, three and four, triple five and six.